I promise it's content. It's not that I want content, guys. I just want to help people with their gear. If you're trying to throw it at me because you're like, look how stupid I am. No, I'm dumber. No, I'm dumber. You're all morons. There's one gear path. I keep saying it over and over again, and you find these creative ways to fuck it up. I play suck cash. Okay. Um, kind of slowed down for a while, getting back into the game. All right, awesome. Let's take a look at this. Okay. So the first thing I want you to do, suck cash is a difficult class um, to play, but there's a couple things that you can do to make your life like a lot better immediately. And it doesn't even have to be on the gear wheel. But if you go to character select like this, okay, and there's a whole lot of different characters. You wanna, you click a, you click down here, you click change character. You know what I mean? Make a new character. There's a tremendous amount of class, like 26 classes in the game. 25 not including hash if you pick any of those other classes i guarantee you you're gonna have a better time okay except for succession nova okay now uh i'm also gonna need your family name um because i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know how in the f you got to two pen black stars before you got to c10 boots you also have a tet fallen god with it with it with kaposhas on with a full round of kaposhas and you don't even have a bell's heart Okay, so like, I don't know what gear path you you were on like previously, but clearly what you're doing is superior to the rest of us. Okay, so please do not allow me to step on your toes. You're just playing the game better than the rest of us. Never mind the fact that you're a hash, so none of this matters. Um, oh, this is going to feel good. Are you guys ready for this shit? Watch this shit right here. Look. Did you hear that? Eight hours of his life just disappeared. Here, I'll take it back. Oh, they're, they're back. They're back again. That's crazy. There they go. It's rough. Get it done, pussy. Thoughts and prayers. Um, Finish your set, second Jatina pen. Okay. Put cuffs on your rings. Make sure they're HP. You're a hash. And you can crit damage on the... Also, this is 150 HP. I don't know how in the f*** that you got to pen Blackstar offhand before spending 150 million silver to get 150... I'm sorry. 20 million silver to get 158 HP. This is stupid. Put some cups on your on your accessories. Okay? Whoops. Um, put the DR on your belt. HP on the rings. You can go crit damage if you're a PvE Andy. That's fine. Uh... Get Vel's heart? Like, this is the easiest gear wheel I've ever seen. Get Vel's heart. Get a pen ogre. Exalt your Vel's heart. Okay. Um. Probably pen ogre next after that. And then pen your, pen your awakening too. Awakening Nova. Working on Coferous Labresca helmet at Jade. I already have enough for the second pen crescent. Oh, 10 bell for the gala. Okay. What happened? You were doing so well. And then you just stopped. You said 600 HP for 2 billion silver? No. Okay. Finish this shit. First of all. Second of all. What the f*** do you mean you're grinding for your next... Stop! Stop. Stop what you're doing. Step away from the mobs. Okay? I don't know what the f*** you thought. That these have a pen on them so you don't have to enhance them. But believe it or not... When you turn these in, once you have the C10 gear, they actually give you Fallen God at base, but that's actually only equivalent to C10 gear. You actually have to enhance this if you want it to be better. Yeah, believe it or not, that actually goes up in level. I know. That's insane. I, and I know you didn't know this because you don't have one. You have two of these that aren't actually duo. Do not finish making your next Labresca or your next Dead God before your previous one is Duo. I'm poor. So are the rest of us. We're all in credit card debt. Deal with it. Okay? Get it to Duo. Stop bitching. Get it done. 
I'm 0 for 9 for duo. I was 1 for 26. Shut up. It's free. 1 for 9. Are you hearing this, chat? That's not even on the average yet. Get it done. You ever got attacked by like a really horny gorilla or something? Dick out and everything? Would you defend yourself? Or let it, ha let it have its way with you? Or would you be the one that's going on the offensive in that situation? Have you seen the size of a gorilla? Like, do you know even the words coming out of your mouth? A gorilla is 900 pounds. Unless you have some reinforced plexiglass between you and the gorilla. It's going to do what it wants with you, regardless of whether or not you fight. Okay? You're literally and figuratively. How big is the gorilla's dick? Yes. You would imagine a gorilla dick on like a 500 pound gorilla. Uh, yeah, you're done. It's chover, as they say. Duo this, duo this. Stop pussyfooting with it. I failed nine times is a lame excuse. You have two of these, which means you took the time to grind out C10 on them. Some panty waste excuse. Get duo done. It's free. Duo is not free. That's the people that haven't tried for try. Okay. Compared to try, duo is a complete joke. Okay. And you also need it in order for it to be cost efficient. All right. Get it done. Now. Once you have duo, you also have a serious other problem to deal with. I don't care that you're an Awakening Nova. Do you see this 302 right here? This is a joke. Okay. Do you see how much more money you'll make per hour at Giants? Because that's where you're grinding anyway at this DP. You will destroy those mobs, my dude. Then you can finish out your DP. You'll finish your Labresca. Okay. Oh, 383. Okay, you can do Giffen Raza if you want to now. You're going to finish your second Jatina pin. Okay. Uh, as you go. Uh, if you're a PvE Andy, you can use um, crit damage. But I'll be honest with you. I think the HP is strictly better, especially on Awakening Nova. Because you have to be able to at least dash in and not die uh, in two hits. Why a Penzarka? Because he's an Awakening. I don't agree with the Penzarka. But it's there. Eventually, you're going to need a pen main hand, but that's not what happens next. Finish these duos. You can finish that out. Get your tet distos. Um, now, you guys are throwing up for the Zarka, but if they come in out with the uh, the dead god, like the fallen god, and they allow you to trade in a C20 Zarka for it, all the Zarka mains are actually going to shit on you. Because they spent 60 billion silver and you spent 150 and you're both going to get to the same place. So this that actually might be the end game build. If they come out with um, Dead God and they allow you to trade in C20 Zark or Danny, which they shouldn't. Um, but. Wow, look at that. Eight hours of your life just sucked away from you just like that. Look how quickly that. Oh, no. Yeah, you're you're OK. Do at least the accuracy for this one. The rest of it is whatever. Um, and I can't believe you haven't done Barrier of Infestation. Your 692 gear score. What are we even talking about? Go kill Zarka like three times. They reworked it, bro. Get it done. What are we even doing right now? Yeah, the first three barriers are text. All right, you're a suck, Megu. Man of culture. Look at that. A DR suck, Megu. Hmm. I still like evasion on suck Megu. Downgrade this. You need some AP. I'm wondering how I'm going to get you AP. I found it. I got there. It's that easy, folks. It's the pen ogre every time. It's not even a question. Also, put some cups on your 
on your rings and belt, you're naked for f**k's sake. Jesus Christ, put on some clothes. Megu means ridiculous. You need DP, so you need to finish your pens, okay? All three of them. Okay, once you have these pens, I want you to put them at C4, okay? C4 is like really, really good. All right, it's going to put you at 360. You can start grinding giants. Like at this point, this is doable. Um, And then you need to get distos. Okay, and it's going to pull your DP kind of low. So as you're doing this, you need to probably put a few levels of coffers into your armor. So that you hit like, so you can stay grinding at giants. Okay, because you're going to eat at that grind zone. Then you can finish out your Labresca stuff. You can do, or you can, I would do the gloves first. A lot of people say, oh, do chests, do the, believe it or not, the flame that's the cheapest is this one. So it's like the easiest to get a hold of. So you should like get, get your gloves to duo. Okay, 366 DP. Uh, and now we can get you to 301. What is this? Why, why do you have this? What the fuck are we even doing? Finish your fucking kudum. How do I even get this far without seeing that? Finish your fucking kudum. Jesus Christ. Okay. You're going to finish your Jatinas. Okay. That's going to give you two Crescent Rings. Because if you say Tungrad Ring, we're all going to make fun of you, okay? Or Tungrad Earring, I'm going to make fun of you. Okay, and you don't even look at the Narc. You're a Megu. You don't need any of that. Because you're not going to get hit at all anyway. Okay. I want you to get the 301 AP. Probably a Pen Black Star. Personally, once you hit this 368 cutoff, I highly recommend hitting 301. That puts you at 301 right there. Okay, once you're 303, like they're over 301, then I want you to get to 380, 390 DP, because then you can grind Giff and Raza. What I'm doing, guys, and like if you guys are all waiting for your gear advice, what I'm doing is I'm trying to get you to certain cutoffs so you can grind certain grind zones and make more money. Okay, so like there should be certain goals in your gear wheel that you're looking for. The first is like 269 AP, okay, with 330 DP. This is basically what you need to do orcs at a solid level. You could technically do it at 320 DP, but it's going to be a little bit sweaty, okay? Uh, at this, uh, like once you get to orcs at this level, I recommend like 281 AP. And then you need to work on 360 DP in that order. Okay, once you hit this, you can go to 301 AP. Keep in mind, this is all AP with Kudum. Okay, then you go to like 390 DP. Okay, uh, essentially what this is doing is this is basically orcs here. This allows you to do giants at like a slower level um, or orcs better. Or you can start to do Calpheon Elvia uh, a little bit with 360, although you're going to be sweating. I really do think that the only thing you can really do is like giants and like Sonal. Um, and even Sonal is going to be a little sweaty with 360 DP. But this allows you to do giants. 301 allows you to do giants better, um, but opens up just a few more grind zones in the game for you. 390 DP will open up underground Gyphon um, and some of the Dekia spots for you as well. Dekia is typically only recommended at 400 plus, but you could do it at 390, assuming you know your class reasonably well uh, and be comfy. I don't recommend doing these spots at nighttime at 390 DP, but you're okay. But like these are kind of like the big cutoffs that you're looking for. Uh, in terms of gear, because these jump you to the, the various grind zones in the game. Is there an APDP cap at the different grind zones? Yes, there is. Um, so if you, if you open this up, it'll tell you right here. If you click refresh, you see my stat right here. I have 833 DP against monsters, all things said and done, and 600 restricted. This is like it recommended you need 550 AP. Okay. 600 restricted means it's soft cap super hard you're gonna make way less money even if i have 833 anything over 600 is not really gonna help you very much that makes sense so there is soft caps for apdp uh, at the various grind zones in the game which is part of why i'm telling you how to basically snowball your gear forward okay have i helped you enough or we're good we're good here yeah you know, we're fine i'll see you in a month or two buddy um and again guys i have a gear progression guide i'm gonna make a new one this week um and it'll be up on my YouTube later in the week. So I'll make a new gear and progression guide a little later this week. But the other one is still really good. All right, there he is. Doing journal while multitasking on other stuff. Suck Megu, 27 days played. Okay. What the f*** 
fuck is this? Did you think I wasn't going to look at this? You've been playing the game for 27 days and the guy has half of his journals done. I have people that submit me my gear, submit me gear that have 720 gear score that don't have any journals done. Stop. Okay. I can't believe the words coming out of my mouth. Stop doing journals. Stop doing journals. Okay. Finish your pen gear. Go grind. Finish your pen gear. Everybody knows how to finish their pen gear, right? Especially for an evasion build. If you go to Jatina, the two that you're going to get for an evasion build are the Griffins and the Leavers. You're going to buy muskins at pen. You're buying it. Okay. Um, and this one you get from the Magnus. Okay. Alternatively, you can get this one from the Magnus. Do these two guaranteed. But in every case, you're buying the muskins. Okay. For DR, it's the opposite. For DR, you're buying the um, the bags, and you're guaranteed penning the Uragons. You're getting that from the Magnus, and then the Griffins and the and the Retina. Finish your pens. You're doing Orcs now. Here we go. Look at you. Um, hmm. I think that you're almost ready. You need to C4 all of your gear first, okay? Because this is going to prepare you for what comes next. Okay? You're going to get a Vel's Heart. That's going to knock you down an AP. That's fine. Um, then you're going to get two Tet Distos. Distos are really good with the, with the Evasion Mega you're, you're, you're gaming here. Okay, this still allows you to be at Orcs. Then you need to finish out one of your Fallen Gods, probably. Uh, you could go to C6 first. is technically the most efficient way to do it. And then finish out one of your Fallen Gods. Again, uh, I recommend the gloves. You're going to get the green one. Don't get the blue one. If you're colorblind, just take your best guess. Um, and then, honestly, finish your pen, Kudum. And then come back and see me. Good shit. Uh, also, right around the time you're going to get your distos, that's when you should do your journals. All right, Viron, let's see it. am I looking at? Oh, this is disaster. This is a total disaster. What in the f happened? How? How? How did you get Tet Debo? Tet Debo? And then you were like, but wait! Pen Tungrad. <laughs> Now I'm the biggest idiot. Yeah, you are, dumbass. Make it. Th th this better be a Jatina. If that's not a Jatina, you're griefing. Okay? You're gonna make it a f***ing crescent. Okay? And you're gonna finish out the horrible plan that you had before. Finish the Tet. Then at least you're getting the AP set from the Tet Debo. I'm gonna swap the pen tongue grab for a pen crescent. When I get a pen Debo earring. Doesn't matter. Should never been a tongue rat earring in the first place. I don't know how the f you got to a pen dawn before you got to like anything else here. You don't even have a pen uh, like awakening. I mean, this is wild. Like you're not even three oh nine. Okay. Before you do your demo, so at this point. You're not getting rid of the Dawn. I like the Dawn on Ninja. I just don't like how early you got it. I blew up my Tet Vahas last year. Just came back. Okay, well, it's just... You, again, get get a Tet Disto then if you have to hold the hold the place. But, like, now, like you got to go for three of these. You got to go for the three set of your griefing. Before you go for anything else at this point, you need to pin this. I know you're probably a Succession Ninja and you don't care, but, like, it does help add to your, your overall stats. Um, you're going to finish your ATOR shoes because you have enough DP to do that. You need to finish that at your earliest convenience. At least put them at duo. I recommend getting at least two armor pieces to try and then going for your pen uh, devos. Understand that this is going to happen first. Okay. 
unless you make backups, this is what's going to happen. I recommend making backups. Most people don't have the discipline to make backups. You're a ninja, so we know you don't have any discipline. Okay. Um, like you have no self-control. That's why there's so much anime on your computer. The fun kind. All right. But like finish, obviously finish this out, finish your ATOR shoes. Uh, and then I would get two tries and then go back and finish your demos. All gas, no brakes. That's how it works. What in the f happened? Are you kidding me? You swept it under the the. You swept it underneath the bed. You're like, Dad won't notice. I could, my room's clean. Don't even look. It'll be fine. Opened it up. <laughs> all this shit came out. Finish your Bartali logs. He did most of Igor's. It looks like, but it finished the rest of them. Okay. You need 401. Okay. How are we going to get you to 401? You can do one try and then C15 here. Um, okay. So C15, 14 gives you the 401, or I mean like the, the extra AP. You could technically finish the DP at C12. But if you're going to go to the, the extra AP, make sure you go to C15 because it gives you four more accuracy. Um, oh yeah, I guess he could exalt the Vels. Um, so yeah, you can leave this at C7 then. <sighs> yeah, just exalt your Vels heart and then put one of your boots at tries. There you go. Um, you are eventually going to need C20 Kudum, so that's uh, definitely going to help you. Um... Put cups on your gear. I don't understand why rangers can't figure this shit out. I hate, I hate crit damage cups, but it looks like you have one here. So I'm just going to even it out. DR on this one every time. Do not put AP on your belt. That is stupid. We make fun of people for doing that. Um, You need AP really, really badly. You are, I can't believe the words coming out of my mouth, but you're... Ranger is flaccid in terms of offensive stats. It's really bad. You have a smaller dick than an archer does. You can't allow that to happen. Um, this is fine. And then you can probably start going for your debos at this point. Uh, keep in mind, there's new debos. I don't know if they have it on here. Yeah, so they have like the debo. Um, I haven't experimented with the debo thing, but my, my thought is that the belt slot is probably your Turo. And that helps you as a ranger pretty tremendously. So if you want to hit, if you want to get the Turo before you go on your Debo grind, probably recommended. Okay. Because that's your end game belt anyway. You're not replacing that. And then you're going to probably eventually go Debo, 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 Debo. Um... A lot of a lot of rangers like uh, ominous rings here too but like if you at least want the three set effect for debos you can just do like the the three standard ones but if you're going to do the five set i recommend the turbo belt here if you're going to do the three set effect for debos you can get your pen debo belt then instead this is crazy bro i just took away 30 hours of his life but you gotta get that shit done bro it ain't really an option. You got to get it done. Now you're an awakening striker. So I'm going to use small word. Um, so it do trick. Buff up is very good. Take cup, not this cup. You say this cup, I say no. Cup, in-game cup, okay? You type, you type, you type cup. Say cup, okay? Cup. You put cup on accessory. Okay, put them together. Don't, don't put this on there. It no go in a monitor, okay? Put the, put the cups on there, okay? This one, you put your cup, cup again. It cups. In-game cups. 
So important. What up, Sanz Sanzus? Sans Sanzus? Sanzus. Junior Sanzus. Um. DP. DP. Defense. Help you big time. Okay. Wow. Oh, many defense. Ah, 401. 401. Get it done. That's why you have to do your journals. Awakening striker finished second pen crescent sitting on 25 bill. This is a Gitino, right? This is this is like you you mistranslated something. It's a it's a Gitina. You you didn't know. Um Please tell me that this is a Jatina at Congre. How could that be a Jatina though, since this is your Jatina? Get rid of this immediately. Nope, played back in the day and came back. It was bad back then too. You fucked up back then too. Okay. Um, the only time that this was good was before Distos existed. You are a striker, which makes it even more egregious. Okay. The striker does not care about the DR loss from a Disto. You strictly profit. You absolutely need to run the Distos. It's not even a question. Get it done. You said you're going to finish your Jatina pen, and that's good. You're going to put HP uh, cups on there, and you're going to like it because you're, you're a striker. What is it with these people? I don't understand, bro. I get down every time I miss something. Like, you just don't see it. Sometimes Maybe it's just like a mental block, man. There's two things wrong. Not one, two. You doubled down. You doubled down. This right here. What are the two things wrong with that picture right there? Gloves are duo too. Okay, there's still something wrong with this picture. DR striker man what are we doing are you mental did scoutmaster kevin get to you at summer camp what are we doing right now who hurt you only evasion on striker i don't care i don't care get the muskins instead stop it oh my god no 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 before you do this okay See, now you got to go through this R, R, like this weird phase where you're like half DR, half evasion. The dick's in, the dick's out. Is the tip in? Is it out? We don't know. Okay, you need 301. Tragic. Tragic. Oh, God, this is so bad. You're in such a bad spot because you got the duo Goddard. Okay, so I recommend getting the Ogre Ring. And then a C7 Kudum. That will put you at 305. Okay. Um, at that point, you need to try to push for 401. You can exalt your Vels. Um, and you can go to C10 here. Uh, get your Ator shoes that's somewhere around here. Get a try. Get put one of them at try. Get your Ator shoes and bet and, and and bug out. C7 Kudum's your best route though, so. How do I know which glasses are better with the R or Invasion innately? When you hit K and you scroll all the way down to the bottom, you're going to see passives. Okay. Any evasion? Nope. Any evasion? Nope. Any evade? Nope. No evasion there. Evasion here? Nope. Evasion here? Nope. Evasion here? Nope. Evasion there? Oh, there's some evasion rate. Still not that great, though. It's only 2%. So, not really. Nope. 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 Okay. If your class doesn't have evasion passives, it's probably not going to be good with evasion. Um, that being said, Awakening Witch, it can be kind of difficult to tell. Awakening Witch is actually better with evasion than... Um, than DR in a lot of cases, just because of how you have to be tanky up close. Uh, also, your class 
your class buff gives you 12% evasion rate on it. So if your class buff is giving you evasion two, you know you're probably an evasion class. Also, DRR is always PVE. No, he's an idiot. Don't listen to him. Um, it's doable. So like if you're looking right there, that's how you inherently know is you go to a guide on YouTube that will immediately show you. There's a reason that this has almost 120,000 views on it. It's because it's the only guide out there that will tell you what the is what um and you can understand innately um it's at 38 34 there you go knock it out if you have a question about one class in particular i can help you but i'm going to remake that guide a little later in this week um dr is not always better in pve some classes that are like really heavily evasion classes like striker or mystic really struggle in, uh, to be tanky at all in pve if you're running dr um, and you can actually go to certain spots faster because you have evasion on. Also, building something because you think it's good in PvE is autistically dumb. Uh, mainly because the pendulum for PvE, as I've said many times, swings back and forth. So there's damage reduction and there's evasion. Okay? And what's good in PvE swings back and forth. I've been playing the game for seven years. I've seen evasion was good for many years, and it swings back to DR. And it's back to evasion, back to DR again. Right now, currently the pendulum's on DR. But guess what? It's already swinging back toward evasion. You know why? Because they keep nerfing the amount of accuracy you need for spots, and they keep buffing how evasion, how tanky evasion builds uh, feel at a lot of high-end grind zones. So it's already swinging back the other way. Um, on top of everything... Else. So right now, yeah, currently DR is better in PvE, but to tell somebody to go for a DR build on an evasion class when late game, by the time they reach it, evasion will probably be better, and they're playing an evasion class anyway, you've totally f***ed that person. You've completely, totally screwed that new player that had no idea. They just listened to you, okay? So no, I'm not going to tell people to go for DR or evasion just because it's, oh, it's better in PvE right now. Yeah, because next month it might not be. Uh, evasion's about to get f***ed when the new hit count update hits. No, it's not, dude. Did you even listen to the Dude, I hate it when people don't listen. Go watch my react to the video and tell me what you missed, okay? I'm not even gonna mention it, but nope, that was stupid too. Jesus. Okay, I helped him enough. We're good. Seventh attempt, 302 fail stacks. So let me get this straight. You did seven attempts for a pen black star, and you're wearing a pen kaposha necklace, a pen kaposha belt, two pen kaposha earrings, a pen kaposha earring, tet begs gloves, and tet uragon shoes. But wait, there's more. He's also wearing Ator's mother power stone. And you decided my next best upgrade is a pen black star. Of course, you needed help. You're an idiot. What are you thinking? Stop hitting for Pen Black Star. It's not time. There's so many better upgrades to what the f***ing shit. Finish your journals. It was my goal. Well, make a different goal, man. It's not efficient. It's not like, it's not even just that it's not efficient. Okay. Finish your pens. I don't know why you're DR. We'll talk about that later. Um, once your pens are finished, it looks like you've got enough DP to go for your distos and your vels. Vels first, then distos. Okay? Vels and distos. You see how you're 303 now? You're perfect. Now you're gonna crank DP until you're blue in the face. And by blue in the face, I mean... Yeah, get this. And C10 your boots. Get your Labresca. Get your red nose, or I mean, get your fallen gun. Okay, uh, now you're gonna get to 305, probably, um, probably ogre. Oh, yeah, my bad. To tet this though. Holy shit. Okay, I can fix her. I want an in-game screenshot. This is trolling me. There's no way. There's no fucking way. 
No. I, this is trolling me. This is trolling out of his mind right now. I want an in-game screenshot or I don't believe it for a moment. There is not a chance. Not a chance that this forgot to duo Fallen God without finishing either Jatina. Happens to have a narc on. Boys, I'm calling bullshit, boys. No journals done. Tet boss armor all the way across. Got all the way to do a falling gun. It's real. I don't believe it. I want the screenshot. Why is this so big? What am I? Buddy, this doesn't. This doesn't help me. Do you realize that this doesn't have your family name or anything? And you have a different alchemy stone. <clears throat> if this is real, you are beyond help. You need to go play Maple Story, man. I'm gonna keep it a buck. Okay. This is not the this is not the MMO for you, man. Okay? Like, you didn't do any of your journals. Okay. You you went for duo fallen god before you got your rings. Before you got did, did anything with Jatinas. You you when you did do Jatinas, you only half assed it and got a narc. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Maybe it's a real narc. Either way, you f***ed up uh in so many ways in this gear, I don't even think I can fix you. Jesus can't help you with this gear like this is bad this is really bad okay you need to and you also i i i i almost just want you to go do seasonal again uh, if i'm being entirely honest like this is holy shit finish your pen finish your pen finish your pen do jatinas for sake do your jatinas do your journals. Um, get get distos. This is not even. It's not even a question. It's not even a meme. I don't even know how you get this far. This is memeing. He's trolling me. I don't even care. It's still a troll. But like, I would feel bad if I didn't help him at all. So like, I would ask why you have tongue rads on. But then I realize you're a hoe. I get it. Here goes eight hours of your life. You're welcome. All right, you're actually looking pretty good here. You have a lot of DP though. You need AP like that, like mad, bro. Okay, I want you to get bells. This is a stupid idea. This was dumb. Okay, stop caring about your DP this much, sure. Megu, okay? Nobody cares. Okay, all that we care about is what's under there, okay? And when we when we look under there, we don't care how big your dick is, your DP is. You probably can just pen this, to be honest. Boom, easy 303. You're there. Um, you need to put some cups on your um on your accessories as well. But once you're 303, you can finish out your DP here. Wait, why don't you... Wait, what What are you doing? Bro, finish your pen boots, bro. What? Okay, finish your distos and your vels and then get pen boots? What the f*** are we even talking about right now? Exalt your vels. Yeah, you're good to go there. Then get 305. Probably with an ogre ring. Alright, this is a new player, so I'm gonna be gentle. Yeah, this is a new player, I'm gonna be gentle. You, um... You're gonna do Jatinas, okay? And then you're gonna do this, okay? And this is stupid, don't do that. Okay. Okay. Alright, this is what your build looks like. You are not gonna do this, though, before you get pen armors. Hey, but you're already going down the wrong path, and I want you to sincerely know stupid people do that. Okay, don't do that. This is your path. Okay, you need to finish your pens first. Okay, then I want you to put C4 in all of your pens. Then get Vels, then get your Distos. Okay, pens first, then C4, then Vels, then Distos. Um, and your Jatinas should happen while you're kind of doing all that stuff. Okay. At that point, you'll be 294, 341. Amazing. Okay. Cause see, then you can just 
blast out a shitload of DP and just run through it. Okay. Then you can just finish out duo fallen gods, basically all three duo fallen gods and just run through grind zones. Um, eventually you're going to need to finish your journals. I recommend doing that around 330 DP. You already have some of the major ones done. You can finish this around 330 DP and it'll put you at 297 because that's in range for the ogre. And you can be 301. Easy peasy. Yeah, he's got to finish Ben Kudum at some point, but he's got so many other issues that I didn't even want to mention it. Anyone's feelings get hurt while I was doing the gear redeem? Good, because I don't give a shit. Oh no, he's retarded. Okay. All right. The gear is perfect, man. There's really nothing you could be doing better. Have you ever had, have you ever had a student come up to you or like a friend come up to you and you're like explaining something to him and you've explained it to him like 85 times. And then the last time they like get it wrong and they're like super excited about it. And you're just like, you got it, man. Good job. Because it's just not worth it. Okay. You need a Vel's heart. I don't know who thought that... I know you went to Tony Two Ghost specifically. And you asked if this was a viable option. But Tony will tell you that he had my foot so far up his ass after he got a cons heart that even he corrected this mistake. Okay, you're gonna get a Vels. The Khan's heart was stupid because Ator's Power Stone exists. The reason that this is stupid, guys, and I know that there's a lot of new players in the chat wondering why this is so dumb, okay? Um, because, like, like, logically, they think it should work, okay? This you can get from the main storyline. It gives you one AP, and then it gives you 4%, 4%, 7%, 4%, okay? Like, this is, this, this is one sheet AP right here. Cons, you can only get one of these. And the only one you want to get is the life one. Even if you're not a life skiller, you get the life one anyway, and then you can sell it if you want to. But like, I recommend holding onto it because it's the best life skilling alchemy stone in the game. Well, third best life skilling alchemy stone in the game. But it's the best one for normal human beings that aren't Byrog. Okay. This gives you one more sheet AP, which is terrible at your current gear score. Horrible. To go for one sheet AP for four billion silver, three and three billion silver, whatever. You'll notice it gives exactly the same alchemy stone stats as the one you get from the main story. Exactly the same. Picture perfect. It's just one more sheet AP and it costs you four billion silver. It's just not worth doing. Um, you could spend way less money and get AP anywhere else in your build. Okay. This is also stupid. It's 600 HP for like two billion silver. Get it done. Okay, 600 HP will make you live in PvE, okay? Remember all that, those crystal things that you constantly have to, like, get back all the time? Yeah, you don't have to worry about that if you have 600 extra AP, HP, okay? Um, after you have the Vels, you have enough DP, you need a Disto. Also, can we talk for a moment how you got all the way to 685 gear score with a fucking cons heart on? What are we even doing? What am I even looking at? Okay, I like the ogre because it puts you at 305 here. Okay, you're eventually going to need to get rid of this and, and get a black star, just so you're aware. Check my room. I don't, I don't want to. Not after seeing that this dude is literally wearing a plus 10 Izaro riding crop. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, plus 10 blue riding crop. That means he's not just stupid enough to buy the blue riding crop he then enhanced it like a dipshit when you could have just literally bought the manos one for the exact same amount of money and gotten more stats at base what are we even doing i haven't even gotten to the gear yet holy shit oh look how clean that is that's that's pretty crisp it's a wizard um, I don't know why you have a C8 dandy, um, but I'm going to, I'm going to circle back to that. Um, 
That's rough. Man. That's 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 really rough. That's bad. You should not have done that. That's that's gonna be a disaster. I coffered it a Brit to hit a bracket. You understand? That was so dumb. Okay, guys, 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 if you ever feel the urge to stick your dick into things that where it doesn't go, okay? You need to think for a moment, is this going to be painful, okay? I want you to lift the flap of the VCR and pull it back out again, okay? Because instead of just getting the Tet Black Star, you decided to double down on an already bad mistake, okay? You could have gotten, for just slightly more AP, you could have, you wasted all this money. C8, this is all wasted. All of the money you put into this, this is what, like 10 bill? 15 bill, something like that, 10 bill? Yeah, you wasted all of that money. 10 bill buys you a Vel's heart. That's three AP, there's your bracket. What are we even doing? Finish your Jatinas. Vel's. Um. Gosh, you're just gonna stay here for a second and you're gonna get some DP. Okay, you don't need Vels right away. You can get your DP first. Uh, you look like you're an awakening wizard, so I'm gonna put you on the evasion. Um, oh, what the f is this, bro? Finish your Uragon. Jesus Christ. Why does everyone forget about their boots, bro? What are we even talking about? Evasion wizard is supposed to be evasion, but since you're already DR, I'll put you on DR for now. Once you get your Ator shoes, you should go over to evasion if you're still playing on awakening wizard. It'll be cheaper at that point. Okay. Uh, you need 360, so... There it is. Uh, then you need 301. I'm actually just going to pump you to 305. God, see? Yeah, I can't just pin a black star. There it is. Do you see? Damn, my math is good. Holy shit. Yep. And then you're going to correct that mistake, Okay. Beautiful. I have a tri black star. That's garbage. Yeah, that's too bad. Sorry to hear that. These aren't even out yet. They're not even out yet. Okay, so. Leifonda, I think, is in the audience. Uh, so I'm gonna ask him. Leifonda, I personally think that the best endgame build now, if you're gonna go for the five-set Debo effect. Is this one. Am I wrong? I think that this is definitely... If you're going to go for five set Debo, I think that the Turo belt is, is probably the best. Like cost efficiently AP wise. I'm pretty sure that this is the way to do it. If you're going to go for the three set Debo effect, guys, it's necklace, belt, earring. Okay. But if you're going to go for five set, you do the Turo belt instead. Okay. Um, I like this build. Uh, on an evasion class like a striker guys because a striker can also do this And you are eating Okay, no the dawn earring is too much of a sacrifice. I think the turbo belt is better. I think the turbo belt is better Okay, he was trolling so I decided to go off on a tangent a little bit Dawn's gives more AP for accuracy, I think. No. Well, let's see. Dawn. Let's see. We're at 333. Ooh. Okay. That's five AP loss. Okay. Versus the Debo. So for the Debo belt, it's 340. If you have the Turo. Six. Seven. Well, maybe not. Well, hold on. Am I crazy? Did I just do that wrong? Pen, pen. We're figuring this out. Hold on. That's only five, right? It's five. This one. 
Ooh, seven. Okay, so... How much accuracy are you losing? This is 12 accuracy. Hold on, guys. I'm mathing this out so I know what to tell people. Ooh, 34. Holy shit. Twenty-two accuracy diff on the belt. This one is thirty-eight. And twelve, so Yeah, the, the earring's just better, isn't it? Because the the Dawn earring gives you thirty-eight accuracy, you only lose five AP. The turbo belt's garbage don't do that guys that's dumb yeah dawn's is just better bro what okay sick normally the belt slot okay i will say that the way that i did it before is still better if you're like a mystic or a striker i think doing this five set is better because you can put a centaur right here and this is your like oh my god you're gaming with this set if you're a mystic or a striker okay um but if you're another class who's not, who doesn't want to run this. It's the Dawn. You do the five set with the Dawn earring. Okay, so now we know. This is good. This is good. The, this is good. Because now I know what to tell people. What in the holy shit has happened in, with this gear wheel? Bear. What happened? What is this? This you're trolling me. You love DP so much, get it done. How do you have all the DP in the world? You didn't do your HP journal. All right, this, this music is way too much of a gas, guys. I gotta... Jesus. Okay, you know that the biggest mistake that you made, right? I don't have to tell you. You, you just know, right? I'm, I, I'm just gonna... Like, Bear, you know, right? Like, I don't have to tell you this time. Look at all the different things Chad is pointing out, and they all miss the fact that you're wearing a f***ing concert. Okay. C10... I think C10 is the least of your worries, man. You don't even have pen boots yet, bro. Stop getting DP. The problem is not your DP. Okay? You have plenty of DP. No more coffers. No mas. Okay? En espanol. No mas. Okay? Rapidamente AP. Okay? AP. Rapido. Rapidamente. Okay? As much AP as we can get. Vels. Distos. Okay. At some point, you should put on some artifacts. Okay. Um, you're probably a succession zerker, so we're just going to pen your black star. Um, and at that point, the pry armor hurts my feelings. I'm, I'm going to keep it a buck. The pry armor is terrible. All right, yeah, so at this point, you finish out your duos, and look at that, you're 380, okay? At that point, guess what? You can C10 your boots like you wanted to, okay? 389, and you're doing Gif and Raza Underground, you're looking good. The gear looks fine, man. The cons heart is egregiously dumb, uh, and make sure that you pen your boots, okay? No more cons hearts. Guys, stop buying cons. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Oh my god, how? There's only one... I, I just don't understand how we can keep the alchemy stone slot up. There's really only one... Like, you think that there's, like, only a select number of ways that people can f*** this up, but, like, every time I open a new gear redeem, there's some new way to f*** up their gear wheel. It's it's almost impressive. You almost admire it. I have a Vels pre-order up. Okay, well, so, all right, so the Vels pre-order is great. Why did you get the 680 gear score with a Perilla Star? Okay, let's just pretend for a moment you have a Vels. Let's look past that shit. 
Are we kidding me right now? Where's your second Jatina? Oh, well, that just came out. No problem. Let's pretend like we're going to finish the first one. Finish your first Jatina. Then finish your next Jatina. Get your bell pre-order done. Okay? Then, I don't know why in the... You're wearing Tuvala earrings at 680 gear score with duo Fallen God on. We're not even at the worst part of the gear. Believe it or not, guys, we're not even there yet. Okay? Believe me, I'm getting there. Okay? It's Tet Distos every time. This was a mistake. You f***ed it up. But perhaps the largest f*** up of all of the monkeys that sit in your cage is the fact that you somehow got to Uragon shoes after making your Dawn's Gloves duo for evasion on a goddamn striker. This is crazy. Did you just decide you didn't have enough DR? Evasion. I swapped classes not long ago. So you just decided that, oh, I'll just go half and half. Pro tip, if you're going to have sex, you either go all the way in or you stay all the way out and you do foreplay. There is no in-between. I'm just going to put in the tip and make my gloves evasion, but then my boots aren't going to be, okay? You go all in or you go all out. Otherwise, you're all stupid, okay? This can be DR until you're ready to roll this to, to evasion. Then once you are both evasion, you're good to go. The Vels is not exhausted. One thing at a time. Okay, he was wearing Perilla's star when we started. Okay. Once you get your shoes to Ator shoes, you make them green, make this one green, and you're good. They're very easy. Oh my god. They're very easy to change back and forth once they're Ators. So I understand not wanting to change the Uragons right now. But you either gotta go all DR or all evasion. If you do hybrid it's bad like you won't be tanky at all you won't have the the benefit of the the dr like it's just it's just bad so you just need to make sure that they're both the same um how do you afford dead god without looking at pen boots the same way that you get to 680 gear score with a perilla start on blindness if you're awakening then you can pen this black star wait Is that a try black star? What in the f are we doing? Stop it. Even if you're succession, you get extra monster AP and you get AP from your, your awakening based on how much a awakening AP you have. Let's see it. How did this many people make this mistake? It's disturbing. Honestly. Like, there's no guide out there. There's zero guides telling them to buy cons art. Every time. There it is. Everywhere I go, I see his face. I, don't, I didn't know this many people had this. No wonder there's a market for cons, dude. Jesus fucking Okay, your 660 gear score. Okay, you need to move out of your parents' house. You gotta grow up. Clean your room. Get your life in order. Get your journals done. Okay. Also, and this is the very important part, this is why cons is garbage. Okay. Oh my goodness. 301. Look at, there it is. That's crazy. Why? Why did you do this too? What are we even doing? Guys. Oh my god. Okay. It's it's more cost efficient to do the Devaraka necklace. Devaraka necklace. Tet. 80 billion silver. 80 
billion ogre 58 billion and it gives you one more ap and you can't in a frenzy blow it up and that is the most important thing about a pen ogre ring okay because if you're in the mood to progress in the morning your pen ogre ring will still be there We've all been in the mood to progress before. You just take shit off and you just start slamming it. I get it, okay? But you can't slam an ogre ring, and that's what's important. Oh, my God. You're not... I'm not done with this guy yet. Um. You need 305. Are you a succession, Wusa? Of course you are. You're not an idiot like Jay Kun. There it is. I like the pen black star here. I don't know why you have a Ted Tungrad. That was stupid. Um, the pen black star looks really good on you. After you have the pen black star, you can go for a tour. Ah, blah, 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 blah. You need more DP. But after that, you can go for a tours. You can probably get this to pen too. Oof, that's a lot. You need to exalt your Vels. Okay, you need to get a little bit more DP, and then you can go for your A-Tour shoes. You'll be fine. Flip, what the fuck do you need help for? You're 309, 401. Do you really not know where to go? Now I'm going to roast your fucking ass. I can't believe you don't... You don't even have a pen black so no This is so dumb. Look how just stupid you subs. I mean, honestly, absolutely ridiculous. Damn. Absolutely insane. I'll see you in eight months. Okay, Dez Kuma, let me see. Okay, fine. Sure, sure. Hey, Dez Kuma, can I get your family name? So as to congratulate you. On getting not one, but two pen black stars before hitting a single other pen on your stupid wheel. But, but wait. But wait. He has C10 Uragons though, guys. Which had to have been the dumbest possible decision that you could have made. See, because I know what you're doing. You're thinking, I'm going to, I'm going to turn this into a fallen god. But see, then you realize that the flame for this is impossible to get unless you go grind for it yourself. So now you're stuck with C10 Uragons and full tet armor, and you can't even turn this into a fallen god. Never mind the fact that you got lucky one day and hit a pen Voltara belt. That's accidental lead into a success right there. That's fine. I know this is going to come as a bit of a shock to you, uh, having 306 Kudam AP with no pens on, uh, but you need to finish out your pens, man. And by finish out your pens, I mean you need to go pen finish out your distos, uh, make sure that you get your pen ogre done. Honestly, replace this with a um, uh, Deborah belt. Uh, you're looking good, big man. Yeah, the idea here is that you get your AP. Once your AP and your DP, those two numbers... Once they match, you actually beat the game. Okay? Yeah, the Kudum. Who even cares about this? Just get to put the Nuva on. At plus four, man. Seriously, though, finish your pens out, bro. What is this, a joke? I promise it's content. It's not that I want content, guys. I just want to help people with their gear. If you're trying to throw it at me because you're like, look how stupid i am no i'm dumber no i'm dumber you're all morons there's one gear path i keep saying it over and over again and you find these creative ways to fuck it up look at this dude put on a tet dawn earring thought he was cool who the fuck puts on a tet accuracy accessory what kind of disgusting shit is that he put his he put his maneuver on so that we wouldn't notice
Quancy, help me. You're a Mewa. Go back to champ select. You've been helped. Um, at this point, you've committed on this terrible decision. Um, so we're just going to keep the C15 dandy. I actually don't mind the Lunar here. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. Hash struggles with some accuracy for sure. They did get a buff like a couple months ago, but class is still a little bit rough on the around the edges on the accuracy for sure. Um, I am a little nervous about your, your AP and PVE though. Um, and I'm wondering how we're going to get you there. Probably C15 here. Yeah. And then you're going to have to pen this at some point too. Okay. Um, as far as your end game build goes, um, the Dawn is fine, but you need to pen it or you're an embarrassment to your parents. Okay. And then you need a pen disto to go with that. Um, uh, I actually, I, no, you can't do pen disto. Well, you're, I hate this in general because see now you're, once you get a pen Dawn, you need to replace this with a Debo. Like that mid game, it's okay to have a lunar like that. At the end game, you just can't you just can't sacrifice the AP because like once you compare it to a Debo, it's just not even close, man. Uh, and then this can be your third Debo here. Okay, the Dawn is fine. Uh, the lunar is fine for now because you're in the mid game. Eventually, you're gonna have to transition it over. Okay. Holy shit! It's not a terrible build. Okay. Yeah. This looks fine. This needs to be duo. Okay. It's pretty easy to get it there. But you need to pen this. You need to pen this. You're really close, so this 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 doesn't cost very much money to do this. You're going to buzz through this really quickly, what I just did right there. And you're going to be 362 DP. Now, Zerker, I understand you like the DP from these. You still need to get Distos in the mid game because you just don't have enough AP and PVE. But before you do that, you need to get a Vels heart. Okay, it's Vels into double Distos. Okay, look how much AP you have. Wow, big dick AP. Ooh. Um, at this point, you don't have enough um, Confris. Okay, we're going to C6 all this crap. There we go. Then you're going to get to 301. Not sure how we're going to do that quite yet. Hold on. There it is right there. We found it. Look how easy that was. Um, you can pen this dandy. Sure, I see you already have it. But you really shouldn't. I'm going to be honest with you. You should never, never make two guaranteed pen weapons. It's just not worth doing. Um, pen the Kudum. Okay, do the guaranteed pen Kudum. Accept the Tet Black Star. That they're gonna that, that you're they're gonna give you okay just hit Y and accept the Tet Black Star for your Iron Buster. If you've already done that for whatever reason, then put on a Tet Black Star on your Iron Buster. Okay. All right. I'll see you in three months. Okay. Do this. I just sucked away thirty hours of your life, and I understand that. Okay. Uh, I also want you to understand that you're a complete parental disappointment, uh, but they still love you. Okay. But understand that it would help if you told your mom that you got distos. Okay. Also a Velzar. And your f***ing boots. I like that you have muskins on. Okay. Then you're going to get a bunch of DP. Okay. I recommend getting your, your gloves. Okay. I recommend putting at least C4 to 6 in your boots. You can finish out these two if you want to, but like, I would recommend getting to 360, then stop and get to 301 AP. Oh, God, you hate to see that. Oh, tragic. You can also exalt your Vels, but, um... You can C7 your Kudum to get you to 301. That's totally fine. Alternatively, you can just skip the th you can just skip this all together uh, and go for a Pen Ogre and just go straight to 305 from 300. Acceptable. Um, the problem is that like you're basically just going to be doing giants for a really long time if you try to get the Ogre too. So just bear that in mind.
Two ra oh yeah, the Jatina. Oh yeah, you are gonna get Jatinas. Yeah, so you don't need the ogre. You're fine. Yeah, you're gonna get your second Jatina. You're gonna be fine. So yeah, this is your build path. Then just ignore the ogre ring. Get here, uh, and then once you're at three, uh, once you're at three hundred one AP, that's when I want you to get to three ninety DP, three eighty, three ninety. Uh, cups are important, extremely. Uh, but like only once you hit six seventy gear score. Or so, I pro guys, we're gonna do the holy autism. Holy shit. We're going to do the gear and progression guide tomorrow, guys. It's going to be okay. I can fix him. What the fuck? Holy shit. How? How? I got lucky, all right. Yeah, well, ha what happened with this? Were you dropped on your head? Were you only lucky in game? Holy shit. Sell it. And don't put the disto on until it's tet. Look at this. Look at the look at look how much better this is. Holy shit. Finish your second Jatina. Okay, you see this? Honestly, who am I kidding? You can't do any of this yet because you don't have pen armors. Okay, scratch everything I just said, except for the tongue rad. The tongue rad is terrible. Put on a capocha and sell it. Stupid. Finish your pen armors first. Then do everything I just told you to do. Okay, pen armors first, and I would put them at C6. Then do all that other shit. Okay, then you can work on your second Labresco and shit. Okay, do not do the distos until you have pen armors. That is stupid. Anyone's feelings get hurt while I was doing the gear redeem? Good, because I don't give a shit. <laughs> 